Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today with a haul from Trader Joe's. I spent $122 and some change, so I will jump right in. Gonna start off with the produce. I got a bag of organic Tuscan kale, and I plan on stir frying that with this green cabbage. I've never done that before, but I've just been craving green vegetables and that combo sounded good to me. So I'm gonna saute um, the cabbage and kale together. I got some um, lettuce and lettuce with slim pickings. Um, a lot of it did not look good at all, but I've been trying to eat a little bit healthier and have salads during the week. So that's why I grabbed that. Grabbed some broccoli and I have never tried these kosher dill pickle spears. I usually like the Clausen's. Um, I'm hoping these are very similar because I've been craving pickles, so wanted some of that. And then I know I tried this a long time ago. I can't remember how I felt about it, so I grabbed a box today and I grabbed some freeze-dried blueberries as well. Haven't tried those before either, but wanted to give them a try. Last time I got these um, fish sticks, Howard and I really liked them a lot. I made them in the air fryer. We are not big fish people, but like I said, I'm trying to do better, try to, trying to stay away from so much meat. So I grabbed these fish sticks and we both liked them. And then I've never tried this before either and wanted to give it a try. And it says it's seasoned batter. So that sounded good. Seasoned batter, um, Alaskan cod fillets. And then I've heard really good things about this coconut shrimp, never bought it before. So I'm excited to give this a try. Let me go back up here. I grabbed a couple of bags of frozen sweet corn. I grabbed this for Harrison, that's our one-year-old. It's, I don't know if it's Bamba or Bamba, but they're little peanut snacks. Um, I'm not sure if he likes peanut butter. I've tried it in other forms, so I'll see if he likes this or not. I also got these smoothies for Harrison as well. So I got the strawberry and I got the peach for him. I've never tried Trader Joe's. I've tried other brands and he likes them, so we'll see. Grabbed some cheese tortellini for our, for this tortellini carbonara I make, and it's really good. Normally I get the carbonara, I mean this tortellini from Aldi, and actually Aldi was cheaper than this. Um, but anyway, got that for that. And then I have been wanting to try this. I'm excited I grabbed some. I love seasoning, so I'm gonna try this citrusy garlic out. And then I always grab a package of their taco seasoning mix. It is so good. The best taco seasoning on the market. I hope they never stop making it. And this one package actually seasons two pounds of ground beef, so. There's that. I used to buy this naan all the time and then I stopped, it's frozen. It is so good, so grab that. Um, I got these for Harrison to try out. I tried the mini peanut butter and he doesn't like them. Like I said, I'm not sure if it's peanut butter that he doesn't like or what, so decided to give the cheese a try. I got these plantain chips for Howard. Normally I get the jerk seasoned plantain chips. They were completely out. So I just got him the regular ones. I thought Howard would like this pizza. I'm not a huge barbecue pizza person. Normally I don't like the barbecue sauce on the pizza, but decided to give this a try. It has chicken, mozzarella, gouda cheese, and red onions. Grabbed a couple of boxes of this mac and cheese. There's actually two servings in the box and we both like this mac and cheese, so it's a quick side for something like fish sticks or something like that. Got these bars for Harrison. Normally he likes cereal bars, but he's kind of funny, so got one box to try, to try them out. And then I just got a, a can of these Cuban style black beans. Tried them a long time ago. They're seasoned already, but I usually end up doctoring them up anyway, but as you can see, it has bell pepper, garlic, onions, etc., red wine vinegar in there. 
And then I love these bars and I usually get them when I go to Trader Joe's. This They sell them other places, but I think they're the cheapest at Trader Joe's. And they were it was $1.99. And basically it's a Twix bar without the caramel. So it has that crunchy cookie in it and the milk chocolate and it is so good. This was new to me. I haven't been to Trader Joe's in a while. I don't know how long this has been out, but this sounds like Howard, my husband. Spicy and creamy Alfredo sauce bursting with Cajun style flavors. Sounds good, and I'm probably gonna serve it with chicken and pasta. There are no instructions or I guess recipes on here, so it doesn't really tell you how to use it, but anyway, sounds good. Wanted to give it a try. I grabbed these mini croissants and you do not have to let these proof. They go straight from the freezer to the oven and we both like croissants, so wanted to give that a try. Now, these I tried a long time ago, I mean like years ago, because I think they're kind of expensive to me. Uh, maybe they're not, but at one pound, four ounces, I think this was $10.99 and they are short ribs, Korean style marinated um, short ribs, so grab that. And then, oh, I'm sorry, I'm reaching here. Um, wanted to give this a try, country peach juice, and it has peach, apple, and apple puree, and five other juices from Concentrate, so that sounded pretty good to me. And then, I don't think I've ever tried these breaded mozzarella sticks, but wanted to give them a try. I hope they're lightly breaded and not really thick. Um, like thickly breaded, but anyway, it sounded good. Wanted to try it. I got these from Harrison. I used to buy these a long time ago too, so hoping that he'll try them and eat them. And then I just needed some more of their olive oil spray. Howard and I both really like peanuts a lot, and these are the blistered peanuts, so they're really, really crunchy, and I love these things, so I grabbed that. I have never tried these before. They've been around forever. Every time I go, I always come up with a reason not to try them. But today I decided, hey, I'm gonna give them a try. So they look really good to me. So excited to try these out. And then lastly, Howard needed some um, coffee. He's been out for a while, so I've never, I don't drink coffee. And that if I didn't buy it for him, I know he hasn't tried it either. So hopefully he'll like this coffee. So anyway, this is everything that I picked up on our Trader Joe's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.